you guys? Welcome back to Chic Blend. My name is Richenza Marie. And I'm Quee. And in today's video, we are doing the five bags to keep and five bags to sacrifice. And if you are new to our channel, make sure you guys go ahead, hit that subscribe button, make sure you guys thumbs up. We always post every Thursday. So make sure you guys hit the subscribe button. We do everything luxury, beauty, and fashion. So let's get this video started. Okay, so before we get started, I just want to say that this tag was made by Fashionably Amy. We'll link her channel down below. And we were tagged by the beautiful Be Fabulous with me, Irene. So this one is for you, boo. Thank you for tagging us. Okay, so since it's two of us, mm -hmm. we are going to do this. We'll do the five that we are sacrificing first. Sacrificing first, and then we'll do our fives that we're keeping. I'm gonna do three, and Ree's gonna do two. Yes. Okay, we ready? Yep, let's get this video started. So, Queen, you can go ahead and go first. So, she's gonna do her first what she is going to sacrifice. This is gonna be so amazing. The first <laughs> sacrifice of the day. Dun, 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 dun. This is my Speedy 35 and it is the regular version. And the reason that I'm sacrificing this dear bag is just because, like honestly, I do have a Speedy Bandolier 35 in the monogram, mm -hmm. and I use that all the time, and I'm just like, this bag is so big for a handheld that I would rather probably just get rid of this and get a Speedy 25 Bandolier. Yeah, you've been one of the 25 for quite some time. Well, you know what? Like, I thought about getting the, the 25, and mm -hmm. then it was just like, for what? You know what I'm saying? Do you feel like you're going to purchase it? I think I'm going to sell this one and get the 25. Oh, okay. Just for travel purposes, you know? Yeah. I'm on my travel thing. When we get back traveling again, my bad game going to be on point, okay? Okay, I see you. So, number two is me with what I'm going to sacrifice first. Ugh. And this was super so hard for me to actually say. So this is the Chloe Drew. This bag came out years ago, but I don't wear it. If you guys, it still has the freaking tag on it. I have not worn this bag once, but it is so beautiful. This was just such a hard decision for me to scrap this purse, but the hardware on it is beautiful. The color is beautiful, but I've noticed that I do not reach for this bag at all. She don't. Yes, it's like the colorway, it's beautiful, but I don't rock it, so I'm scrapping it. I feel so bad for this bag. Yeah. This, this bag <laughs> is beautiful. It is okay? beautiful. I have the cement pink and I'm not scrapping man. so. Mm -hmm. Next. So number three. The Chanel Classic Flap in Medium Caviar Leather Black sil black with silver hardware. Why are you getting rid of this? If y'all seen me unbox this, you know that I was just not excited about this size. Like mm -hmm. honestly, I wish I would have got this. Uh, I wish I would have switched it. I wish I would have gotten the jumbo in the silver, just because I feel like it's more casual. Mm -hmm. And I feel like I would have got. I should have got the gold hardware in this size. Instead of silver. yeah, it's just so small. For like, I feel like this could be a dressy bag, you mm -hmm. know. So I just feel like it's too small, and I'm just like, girl, like I need a jumbo in my life. I prefer a jumbo. And I'm the small bag girl. I like the small. So she like the big bag. So I can see why you're scrapping it then. Off with her head. <laughs> <laughs> That's so silly. <laughs> Number four is, oh my gosh, I cannot believe that I'm scrapping this one. I love this bag. Yes, I love this bag too, but I actually have a love-hate relationship with this purse. Anytime that I do go out, I get so many compliments about this bag. It is beautiful, but listen, this material it's trash. It's velvet. <laughs> it's velvet. Dang. Yes. It's trash. Honestly, I got it in the velvet and I wish that I had bought it in the leather. With velvet, it scrapes up very easily. It has, it starts to get like this whitish hue to it and I do not like that. Although it's beautiful, I am the type of person that I am very carefree with my bags and I literally have to protect this bag. So although I love it, <laughs> I would definitely trash this and I would get this in leather. And this is the Gucci Mama in black and gold. So, last but not least for me, 
has to be my Chanel statement flap in these size. What is this? Oh, the small or the medium? Yeah, I think that's the medium. But I love this purse. Okay, so with this bag, the reason why I'm just like, uh, she could kick rocks <laughs> is because, like, I want a classic flap. Mm -hmm. This was never on my wish list. And I found that when I put, like, buy bags that are not on my wish list, I just don't love them like I'm supposed to be loving them, you know? Yeah. I'm supposed to love this bag, which I do really, really like this bag. Mm -hmm. But I'm just like, you know what? I could sell this bag and give me a classic flap. You know? Yes, and she always says that. Like anytime she breaks out this purse, she like, I should have just sold this and got something else. But I personally love this bag. Oh, oh my goodness. She gone. Off with her head. Deuces. <laughs> So now we are gonna move into the bags that we are absolutely going to keep in our collection, honey. So Queen, go ahead and go again since you do have three. I only have two. Okay, so the first bag has to be my yeah. Palm Springs Mini. When I tell you this my router, dad, this my number one chick, this my bad okay. and bougie. Okay. I take this bag everywhere. Like I take this bag on vacation. This bag come to the porta potties with me, you know. <laughs> Coachella. Oh, this bag was, you know, hanging in there. Like I love this bag. It fits so much, and it's beautiful. So it this is beautiful. I love that. It's my number one, honey. And a lot of these bags, you guys, we have already did reviews. What can fit? We'll list some up above. We'll tag them for you guys, so you can go ahead and watch those. So, you guys know the Chanel Queen Scraps. Oh. Well, I am going to keep her. Booyah, baby. <laughs> <laughs> so, Queen, she has her purse in the medium, and I have it in the small. And let me say, I absolutely love this size. And I feel like I'm going to keep it because this is actually the only Chanel bag that I currently own. So, Actually, this was this is the thing too. This bag was supposed to be my bag. Yes. But I was the good big sister. She likes smaller bags, and yes. she was like, "But I want that bag." So I went for the medium, and she got the small. But she wear this bag, so yes. yeah, that's definitely a keeper for you. And I absolutely love it. It's great for going out. I could wear this as an everyday. Dress it up, dress it down. So this is definitely a keeper. Would you say this was a good first Chanel bag? Does yes. it make you want to get more into the brand? Like, yes, I want more. Honestly, I feel like with this, it has done its job on Chanel. On me, so one done? Chanel. I'm not gonna say that I'm done because yeah, never know, never say never. But I feel like with Chanel, the prices, the increase has been just astronomical. So I don't think I'm gonna get another Chanel, but you just never know. That's why I'm selling my statement flag yeah. because the prices are freaking crazy right now. Number three. <laughs> this is the, oh. yes. So nice. The Gucci Dionysus. And as you see, it is with the black suede. And I love this bag. This bag, every time I wear this bag, I just feel like I'm on, like. It is beautiful. Yeah, I could wear this every day. Like, I could wear this to dinner, even though it's kind of big. Mm -hmm. Like, I just love it. I just feel on all the time. Like, I be walking around looking like a bum. Hair be all <laughs> over the place, be looking super busted. Like, my sister told me I looked like a, um, what'd you say, a rich homeless a rich, person. Yeah, I was the like, other day. Yeah. <laughs> She was dressed in these big clothes, but the big clothes were super nice. And then she had on this bag. I was like, girl, you look like a rich bum. <laughs> and she was like, oh, okay, I like that. <laughs> so, yes, I love this bag. You, If you get one, you're going to feel on too. Although, I would definitely suggest do not get the one with the nude bag. Like, if you decide to purchase this bag, mm -hmm. even though people been saying it's out. Girl, it is not out. This it's bag not. will never be out of style okay yeah it's such a statement piece yes yeah, so if you get the black suede it's definitely going to last longer and it's not gonna look dirty so yeah we going with this one i love it Woo. okay so number four is oh let me take it out the packaging oh so She's if you guys lady. know you know we actually did a complete unboxing of this purse so this is the Louis Vuitton bicolor pochette Matisse 
and look at this super bag, pretty okay the reason why i'm going to keep this is because this is actually the most aesthetically pleasing bag that i have in my collection so why would i get rid of this like look at this louis vuitton did such a great job with the structure they and did. yeah it's just so beautiful so yes i'm definitely going to keep this bag this nude color, I could just see myself in the summer just rocking the brown with the nudes. Ooh, girl. Oh, <laughs> and my sunglasses. Oh, girl. Hey, oh, oh, girl. girl. Like, <laughs> why would I get rid of this? This is so nice. So this is, this a keeper, it's a keeper. Yeah, baby. Oh. <laughs> so number five is Queen. No. So is this the last one? This is the last okay. one. Yeah, you are just Chanel in it out today, girl. Mm. So this is a keeper. I'm never getting rid of her. This was my holy grail bag. This was the bag that when I was a little girl, I was like, oh, I'm going to get that Chanel classic flap with the black hardware. That's At that nice. time, I didn't know nothing about caviar leather, though. Uh -huh. But yes, this is the Chanel Jumbo black with gold hardware. Yeah. Caviar leather. I love that. Holy grail, that's all I gotta say. Yes. <laughs> and if you guys can see, we are like the black and gold girls. We yeah. love the black and gold hardware. So yes, oh my gosh, this tag was so super fun. I love doing it. Oh, are and we this, done? Yeah, we're done. What? No! <laughs> actually very very hard for us to come up with these bags because of course they are all in our collection so we love them all but if we had to choose you guys know which ones we would keep and which ones we would sacrifice so yes all right you guys so that was the end of our video and now for the question of the day is in your collection which bag would you keep and which bag would you sacrifice and make sure you guys Put that answer down below in our comment section and you know we post every Thursday on luxury beauty and fashion so we will see you guys next week and don't forget to stay what? Chic. Chic squad. Out. Out.